This is a video I've been wanting to make for a long time. It's the last astral projection I had as a child. I was 10 years old. It is about a metaphysical experience of reincarnation, but more than that, it's about the cellular memory that we have, that all of our lives, past, present, and future, exist in the present moment at the cellular level. Hi there, beautiful souls. I'm Michelle Duque. Welcome to my channel, Soulful and Unplugged a channel about the spiritual awakening journey where I show you how to live a more joyful life by helping you navigate your human journey through your soul's perspective. What happened was I, uh, I was sleepwalking and I went downstairs to the living room or the family room where my parents were and I started talking about this baby that I was having backwards. Um, I was reliving a life that I'd had. I was 24 years old and I was pregnant and there was something very wrong with my baby. I wanted to give birth but I couldn't. There was something that was really wrong with it and I was in terrible pain. So in that moment the pain was so excruciating at what I was experiencing that I snapped into a metaphysical experience and an astral projection of having lives backwards. So this pregnancy that I was reliving, I experienced going back into a single cell of that baby. And then through that cell I entered this incredible infinite field of energy where I went into this kind of tunnel and back to another life and back and back and back. And I must have gone back about a thousand lives. It was an extraordinary experience. And it left me with an indelible experience of the present moment, of what is in each and every cell of our body. We have this cellular memory of all our past lives, and none of it is in the past. Everything is in the present moment. Everything is in a single cell. What I saw in that experience is how there are no coincidences, that absolutely everything is set up for us to come here and learn our lessons, really learn our, our important soul lessons, in that everything is, is from the moment of our birth programmed in us for us to then have to relive through that programming so that all the lessons that we've not learned in our past lives, we are given the chance to finally learn in this life. And the amazing thing that really stood out for me was that as you heal the present moment, in a moment of decisive choice, you make a choice to stand up for yourself. You make a choice to veer in a way you've never veered before. You really choose something that takes your life in a whole different direction. In that moment, you actually heal all of the past lives where this lesson wasn't learned. From my very first experience where I experienced infinite consciousness, you know, it really went full circle. In that first experience, I saw that there really is no time. Time doesn't exist, that everything is in the present moment. But also in a singular point, everything exists and nothing exists. And that means time as well. If we really do take into consideration this idea that time doesn't exist, when we move away from the third dimension, when we take our consciousness and move it to a wider consciousness, what exists is really the present moment. And in every single one of our cells is everything we've ever done and everything we ever will do. It's a very big concept to, to take in. I know it's quite difficult to understand and what I always try to do in my channel 
on my channel is translate these experiences in a way that you can be helped with in your life. The most important thing is the true power of now. We really do have all the power right now to change in a moment to stand up for ourselves when we've never stood up for ourselves, in a moment be courageous where we've never been courageous, in a moment find our true voice and speak it the way we've never spoken it before. None of what we are living and none of what our upbringing has been is a coincidence. Everything is set up for us to reach our greatest potential and reach our greatest growth. Sorry, the sun's really, whoa, is it bright. If we stop in this moment and ask ourselves the question, what is it that I can do in this moment to change the course of my life in a way I've never done it before? What would that be? And if I can ask myself in this moment, what needs most healing? And make a commitment to go in that direction and heal that aspect of ourselves, of myself. In that one cell of the baby, that, that past life, me as that past life, that baby was carrying back in that, to that one cell, was everything. And in our bodies, in our cells, we do have this incredible, infinite energetic field where everything in the present moment exists. And that is where we hold our true power. What would be an extraordinary thing for you to do that would really shift the course of your life? What that does is it brings you in a new energetic field. Within each atom there's an infinite amount of energetic fields. And you are vibrating, your life right now is vibrating at a certain frequency. By doing a simple shift, that frequency changes and you enter into a different energetic field. But the power is only in the now moment. So think about what choices you are afraid to make. What things would really be something that would take your life in a whole new direction? All of your fears and all of your reticence about doing something different is because it's not only this life that has programmed you to have those feelings. It's every life that you've had before. All of your past incarnation are also contributing to this programming through this cellular memory that is alive in you right now, in this moment. And the biggest imprint for me from this metaphysical out-of-body experience is the enormous power of choice we have in the present moment. Absolutely every event in our life is perfectly set up for our greatest soul lessons, bringing us to crossroads of transformation through our free will choices and actions. Have you ever asked yourself, why does this keep happening to me? Have you ever found yourself knowing what you wanted to say or do, but were completely paralyzed, unable to speak or move? Do you ever wonder why it's so difficult to change? Why the same challenging situations reoccur over and over and over again? Well, <laughs> all of it is by design. It's your soul's blueprint for this life, alive in you in the present moment through the cellular memory of every other life you've ever had. Thank you so much for all of your love and all of your support. I cherish this beautiful community that we're building here and I wish you a most beautiful week. Sending lots and lots and lots of love. Bye for now. Hi Miranda. <laughs> Hi. Come on Roxy. Just doing my vlog. <laughs> okay, Roxy, come here. I gotta tie you up again. All right, there we go. Come here.
Hey, Roxy, gotta tie you up. We'll go swimming in a bit. We'll go swimming in a bit. Hi, Lucy, hello.